Hey guys, it's Billy and welcome back to Princess Polly's YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you six different outfits inspired by streetwear. Streetwear can be completely different to every single person, but I thought I would show you guys my interpretation of streetwear and how I would style all of these outfits. So when I think of streetwear, I think of baggy clothes, edgy if you want to be comfortable, basics but also with staples that are in your wardrobe. Streetwear is 100% one of my face styles to rock. So without further ado, let's get into today's video. So the first outfit I have to show you guys is an all black fit which I know a lot of you will love. So we have this Powerpuff graphic tee. This shot actually does run quite oversized but for more of a baggier fit I did size up in this and get a size medium. So the main focus of the outfit are these maple leather pants. I did size down in them so I did get a size extra small because I do find that they run really big but I have literally lived in these pants all through winter. They are so comfortable. I find that they are so flattering on. Another quick thing I want to say about these leather pants. They do have a real pocket which I love and on the inside they are nice and fleecy and warm I've had so many leather pants that are actually leather on the inside and it's just not comfortable at all but with these maple streetwear pants they're very comfortable on the inside. This is such a cool girl, effortless but chic outfit. And you can also style this top in so many ways. You could either tuck it into your bra and wear it as a little crop top. You can just leave it hanging out and have more of a casual baggy fit. You could just tuck one into the pants. There's so many different ways, which I love. You could also tuck on a baseball cap with this outfit, which I think is very cool girl vibes. I think this outfit would be perfect just to chuck on if you're running late because I'm guilty, I am always running late. So this is a perfect outfit to chuck on. You still look super put together and chic as well. So this is the second look. We have a white bralette with the maple flare jean. I absolutely love wearing tiny little bralettes and then like big baggy jeans or big baggy trousers. If I'm gonna wear a tight top, I love having the bottom half of me to be really baggy and oversized. So think of like oversized jeans or baggy pants. It's so flattering on so many different shapes and body sizes. So to go with this outfit, I have started with this oversized corduroy long button up shirt. I have fallen in love with this so much. It was actually my first time at trying it on in the the try on portion and I'm going to be purchasing this after this video. I did size up in this button up shirt to give more of a boyfriend laid back vibe. So I did get this in a size 12. With basic outfits, I love layering heaps of gold jewelry because I do find that it really does dress up an outfit. Chuck on it some gold big hoops, chunky earrings, some chain necklaces. This is such a staple in your wardrobe. I feel like you look so chic and effortless as well. Printed pants are so in at the moment. I feel like they were trending late last year and throughout this whole year. When I think of printed pants, I think of Kendall Jenner and her style. They also do have a little slit at the ankle, which I think is super flattering as well. When I was trying on this t-shirt, I did get a little bit of makeup on it, so just please ignore that. But to finish off this look, I paired it with an oversized leather black jacket. This is a great outfit if you're transitioning into seasons. This is a very versatile outfit, so you could dress it up with some black boots or you could dress it down with again my favorite white Tessa sneakers. This wouldn't be a styling video if I didn't incorporate a bustier slash corset top. For the next look, we have one of my faves. This is called the henna top. I personally own this top both in black and white, and I also do think it comes in blue as well. So to pair with this corset top, we have these super baggy, distressed, light blue denim wash jeans. This gives me very Bella Hadid vibe. You know how she always wears the big baggy jeans and then a cute tight corset top. Usually I would wear these jeans in a size six for more of a high-waisted tight fit. But since I was going for more of that baggy effortless look I did size up two sizes so I did get this in a size 10 with a basic outfit like this I love to pair some bright colored accessories neon green heels would look insane with this I think in the charm portion I just styled it with a vibrant blue bag I would honestly wear this outfit anywhere I'd wear this to work I'd wear it for drinks I'd wear it if I was going on a picnic a barbecue you name it I would wear it I think this outfit is amazing and it's definitely one of my faves this is the perfect summer fit, but will also keep you warm for them at chillier night. So we just have a basic white graphic tee. I did get this in a size 8. So to style this graphic tee, I did pair it with the Xena denim shorts. Again, I did size down in these because I do find that they run a little bit big. So I got a size 6 instead of a size 8. I think this light wash blue denim is like the perfect shade for me personally when I'm looking for denim to wear. So you could just leave this outfit how it is. But I have just started with another long sleeve button up, super baggy 
cute button up show. Get this in a size 12. It's also one of my favorite outfits as well, even though it's super basic and effortless. It just looks cool. It just really just gives me a cool girl vibe. So to go with this outfit, I have two shoe options to show you guys. So the first ones are these high top butterfly sneakers. High top sneakers are very on trend for the street style look, but if you do want to spice things up, I do have these knee high cowboy boots. Say no more, this is honestly one of my fave outfits and I know I said that for nearly every single look. I just love. Love, love, love. For my final last streetwear look, we have these Douglas boots. This is the main focus of the look. These shoes have been a huge fashion trend in 2021. At first I wasn't sure if I did love these style boots, but since putting this outfit on, I absolutely love these boots so much. So to go with the boots, we have this whole neck knitted mini dress. To go with the dress, I have this oversized blazer. I did size two sizes up in this for more of an oversized fit, so I did pick this one up in a size large. I would wear this with some black slim shades. Like that the ultimate cool girl fit. So guys, that was today's video and my interpretation on streetwear styled outfits. I hope you enjoyed. As always, everything will be linked down below in the description box so you guys can shop all of these looks down below. Also, make sure to give this video a massive thumbs up so we know to keep filming more videos like this. But we will see you guys in our next video very soon. Bye!